From ABC News World Headquarters in New York, this is World News Tonight. Good evening, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us on this Easter Sunday. We do begin tonight with a dangerous storm system on the move. More than 20 million on alert for flooding in Southern California. Heavy rain washing out this highway in Montecito, leaving a long line of stranded drivers. Rain causing spin outs and crashes on a drenched highway in the San Fernando Valley. This highway near Big Sur was forced to close after a section of it fell into the ocean. In Long Beach, the rain and gusty winds caused this tree to fall onto a house, but fortunately, the mother and son inside the home are safe tonight. This comes as millions prepare to head home after a long holiday weekend. Our weather team is tracking it all. Danny Beckstrom from our partner station, WABC in New York, leads us off. Tonight, more than 20 million people in Southern California remain under flood watches. We are still seeing some pretty strong cells moving through this morning. In northern Los Angeles, heavy rain on Highway 101 causing this sedan to spin out. Moments later, a second car colliding into it. No major injuries reported. Oh my God, this car is flooded. In Montecito, cars flooded on this part of Highway 101 after heavy rains turned the roads into a river there. And in Long Beach, the rain and gusting winds causing this eucalyptus tree to collapse onto a house with a mother and son inside. Luckily, no one was injured. Parts of Highway 1 near Big Sur forced to close after this 10-foot section of the southbound lane collapsed into the ocean near the Rocky Creek Bridge, prompting officials to rescue stranded passengers. Southern California has been inundated with relentless rounds of rain this year. Downtown Los Angeles alone received more than a foot of rain in February, making it the wettest month the city's experienced in 26 years. In the San Bernardino Mountains, intense snowfall and high winds bringing low visibility and treacherous driving conditions. Stranded cars and vehicles along the roads, drivers trying to dig out over a foot of snow since Friday night. A mixed bag on this April Eve, and Danny is back with us now. Danny, this storm system is making its way across the country, now threatening the heartland. Time this all out for us. It is, Lindsay, heavy rain, mountain snow impacting the West Coast all weekend long, and it's not over yet. Flooding concerns continue for Southern California this evening, with alerts in effect across several states, including winter weather hazards for much of the Rockies. Tomorrow, our attention turns to the middle of the country as the system slides a severe thunderstorm threat to the heartland. Cities like Dallas, Tulsa, and St. Louis on alert for a potential severe weather outbreak with damaging wind, large hail, and possible tornadoes. An enhanced risk, that's level three of five, for severe storms for much of Oklahoma, Missouri, and Illinois. Illinois after dark on Monday. Tuesday, the threat shifts east again, with parts of the south and mid-Atlantic facing the potential for strong wind and large hail. The system also a big rainmaker here in the northeast, with rounds of rain through midweek. After New York City saw the fourth wettest march in recorded history, it's going to be a rough start to the work week for so many. Lindsay? Lots of varied concerns there weather-wise. Danny, thank you.